Hey everybody, welcome to the very first installment of How to Build a Yellow Aircraft uh, F-16. Um, this is mine I got, uh, probably got it, I guess I got it back in March, but uh, I've just really now started to kind of go gangbusters on it. Um, it will be powered with a uh, Stumax EDF unit. I have ordered the uh, Stumax inlet ducting specific to that engine. Um, I just like the way that sounds, a little bit smaller, uh, less weight. Um, so I'm going to give that a try. Um, I really haven't done a whole lot on it yet. Uh, I've test fitted the landing gear as you can see here. It's not actually glued in. Um, I'm going to have to make some modifications actually. The servo arm, the steering arm is uh, rubbing against the ducting there. You can kind of see the uh, silhouette of that. Anyways, I'll have to shim it up on the advice of uh, uh, Gunrad on RC Universe. Um, I have built one wing. Um, I'll show you guys how to build the other one when I go at it. I kind of want to work out all the quirks, kind of see how, how it all goes together. But um, I mean, I'm kind of proud of myself there. Look at the uh, got the tolerance there, pretty pretty tight. So, anyways, um, got the rear horizontal stabs just about ready to glass. I just need to add the uh, cap piece to the inside edge here. I've got the cap piece here. It's not actually glued on, but uh, I'm just about ready to do that. I want to get the other wing built first uh, so that I can kind of measure the angles of everything. Um, the only former I've actually glued in is this rear former, so haven't really missed a whole heck of a lot. That's actually an easy step to the whole construction, so... Anyway, um, and I have kind of skipped some steps because I don't have the parts I thought would have uh, come with it. I need the, um, the valves to open up the doors and stuff there, so I skipped the door step. Um, not going to be gluing in any of the uh, front formers here until I get everything just right. So I have not glued in that or that. It's just kind of test fitted so that I can uh, test fit the wing. Um, oh, one thing. Um, I am going to need to reinforce that uh, inlet ducting. Um, again, uh, Gunrad on RCU um, said that at about 70% power it was starting to collapse. So we will need to reinforce that. So anyways, that's the progress that I've got so far. And uh, see you on the next episode.